everyone today is Tuesday and I'm just at work right now I just got to work pretty much I just opened up my mail I will show you what I got in the mail today which is so exciting and I'm just starting my day out by drinking a bang energy drink uh, coffee just wasn't tasting very good I don't know I had a couple sips and ended up dumping it out so I grabbed this on my way out and let me show you what I got in the mail today all right, so I only work Tuesdays and Thursdays here, and this is where we get our mail to is at the Canic, so I, I don't check it except for when I'm at work. So, guess what I got today? It was a gift from Keto Diamond. This is her address. She has this address listed on her um, YouTube channel. Um, I will link her channel down below. She is fantastic. She does daily vlogs of her progress and she just um, celebrated her wedding anniversary and went on a little trip which was nice to see so i will link her channel down below make sure you go and and subscribe to her channel she is amazing and this is my address as well too it's it doesn't show any other address other than my box number so if you want to send me anything shameless plug there you go but she had sent me her daughter actually ended up having i guess two of these or something and it's a power pack for my cell phone and I am so thrilled because now that I'm doing YouTube, I find that it really drains my battery really, really fast. So yeah, this is the case that it all came in and battery powered charging case. Yeah, so this is kind of the whole thing and it's a power case so you can charge this. Um, you charge this before you go on a long trip or like for me, it might even be daily if I know that I'm, I'm recording. So you charge this on the bottom just like you would your phone and there's a power button that you would leave off when your cell phone is fully charged and then when you need it so you put your phone at the bottom there and then let's say your your phone is running on low then you would turn it on and then it takes the power from this power pack to charge your phone so that you're never without a charged cell phone love it i'm so excited thank you so much keto diamond and make sure you thank um destiny for it as well too i believe it was uh, destiny her daughter that had offered it to me so yay also too i got a small order from amazon that i ordered i think it was actually like on friday so i just got it in yesterday um i noticed all right, so that is uh, replaceable heads for our electric toothbrush. So hopefully it'll work. I think there's like 10 in here or something like that. It was a really good price, like 20 bucks or something. And then my daughter got me some of this face cream for Christmas last year, actually. And uh, between this and the ponds, I usually use it daily. And I ran out of this and it really is good. It doesn't affect my skin because I have really sensitive skin with my eczema and such. So this one is amazing. It's hyperallergenic and 100% fragrance free. It works really, really good. And it's like, I want to say 16 bucks and it lasts me a long time and really, really good stuff. And of course I was out of some of my supplements. So I get them off of Amazon. They're a really good price. So I ended up getting the magnesium. And I was all out of my turmeric as well too. And this has helped pr tremendously. I've been out probably now for, I want to say close to a week and I can notice it. I notice it when I'm getting up and down from the couch when I'm sitting for a long time. I just kind of hobble like an old lady. But now that I got this, hopefully in a few days I'll be feeling good again. And then, woohoo! This is where I get my perfect keto collagen from, is from Amazon. It is spendy, it's $50. Um, I use a half a scoop every day with my coffee and it lasts me probably about two months. I'm actually gonna put the date on this. I'm notorious, my husband hates it, but I'm notorious for putting dates on things to see how long they last. Does anybody else do that? Like, especially Costco. I'm horrible for that. I write it on like the garbage bags and the laundry detergent and everything. So I'm going to do that with this. I'm going to put today's date because I am out of it and I'm going to see how long it lasts me and I will keep you guys posted. All right, so I am at work. I'm going to have a little snack. It's almost 12 o'clock and it gets pretty busy here in the post office usually around lunchtime because everybody comes on their break. So I'm just going to have a little snack first and then probably... Um, afterwards, I'm going to have my lunch probably after one. This is just some pork rinds with some Asiago dip that I get at Walmart. I've tried different brands and such. I threw away the container because I used the rest of it. But um, 
I will try to maybe buy some more tomorrow and if I have a chance I will throw it in this clip um, but it's the best or else I'll throw a picture in it if I can find it online but it is the best dip ever I've tried other brands and they just don't even compare to this one so this is one of my favorite snacks to have um, just some pork rinds and the dip and I'm still working on my bang there all right guys I am having my lunch I am having a cheeseburger casserole I made it last night. I never did record it because I wanted to try it first before I filmed it, but it is really good. I had a little taste of it last night after it was done cooking and it's really, really good. So I'm going to link the recipe that I used down below and literally tastes like a cheeseburger. So good. Your family will love it. Even my kids liked it and they're 18 and 20 and they had that just with some macaroni on the, on the side. Really good. This is my lunch for today. All right, everyone, I'm going to have something sweet after I ate that, and I made some muffins last night. These are banana caramel muffins that I got in a package, and I believe I got it in one of my subscription boxes. I can't remember which one, but I will show a picture of the package uh, right now, but they are so good. I They made nine, and I had two last night, and I brought one today for lunch. So good. Wait till you see the inside. One sec. They legit taste like a uh, non-keto muffin. <laughs> so good. All right, I feel like I need some sugar. I am going to have just a couple of these no sugar added. I usually just keep them here at my desk. Um, they are 16 carbs with the 16 sugar alcohols. Just don't have too many of these. They will make you sick and you will need to run to the bathroom. Sunset, it is so pretty one thing I don't see the sunrise anymore but the sunsets I do see and they've been awfully pretty these days all right who gets done work and puts on their pajamas when they get home I do um it is uh 6 24 right now I haven't had my supper I thought I would actually just clean up a little bit before I make something so let's go ahead and do that trying to save this plant for weeks and I don't know what happened to it but I think it's it's dead I think it's time to change it out I have a really healthy one that's over here and it's doing so good so I think I might just replace that
There we go. Hopefully, like this one is growing so good that hopefully that it doesn't, you know, because of the macrame, hopefully it doesn't like hinder the progress because it is doing so well. But I guess I'll just keep an eye on it. I should just buy a fake one for there, to be honest. Like the saying is pretty much legit for all my life. Plans. up around the house and it's a little bit after seven and I'm just gonna make my last meal here and I felt like a grilled cheese and I have been so addicted to these chaffles I will put a video up where I um, list the ingredients I did an egg fast with them however I didn't put the coconut flour and the baking powder in it when I was doing that egg fast but I will link the original one so good they crisp up so nice and so I thought I would make a grilled cheese with this like all right, look at that. So good. Like I said, I'm addicted to these chaffles right now. Like, oh. sorry guys, I'm looking like this. I am beat. And I always take my head off when I eat, no matter what. My husband is like that. He was in the military, and that is his probably, I think it's his second pet peeve. His first pet peeve is talking with your mouthful, which I hate too. And I would have to say my number one pet peeve is, um, my number one pet peeve is probably slurping. That slurping just annoys me so much because it's unnecessary. There is no reason why you need to slurp. <laughs> um, like I guess I could understand like hot soup or something, but like when it's the end of a drink, like or a milkshake, like it's, it's done. <laughs> like give it up. What is your pet peeve? I want to know what pet peeve um, you guys have, what your number one pet peeve is. I would have to say that's mine. I, that's always been kind of my number one pet peeve. My kids know it. My husband know it. And uh, I just can't handle it. All right, so I am going to have this grilled cheese truffle. And I'm going to have it with one of the black cherry zevia that I had bought. These are really good. By the way, I did a test, test taste when I bought them. Or, no, actually, I just bought one. That's what I did. I bought one to see if I would like it, and then I did, and I ended up buying a six-pack that um, was sold at Superstore here in Canada. So highly recommend. Black cherry is, like, my favorite flavor for anything. I love cherry. So I am going to have that, and we'll see what else we have. We might have something sweet afterwards. All right, guys, I'm just going to watch a little bit of TV and have half of this chocolate bar that I'm addicted to, the Lily's Peppermint White Chocolate. Really good. I get it on the Nutra Market website, which is always linked down below. All right, everyone. I am done eating. That chocolate bar was the last thing that I'm gonna eat tonight. And the kitchen is all cleaned for now anyways. It's only like Tuesday today. So I'm going to post this video on Friday. You will see it. And I just wanted to do a quick video of kind of what I eat in a day and just a quick cleaning video. And finally, I was at home to film this actually because most of the time you see me either on my way to work or, you know, I'm getting ready for work. And so today was kind of a chill day. I did work from 9 until 5.30, but then you got to see me at home and what I do when I'm at home and 
how I look when I'm at home and when I don't have to actually like go in public and, and be customer service all day long. So this is me, this is the real me. And uh, although I do like have pretty makeup on and dressing up, I do enjoy that. But this is me pretty much probably like 70% of the time, I would say. Maybe actually a little bit less right now because I've been working so much. Um, let me know if you guys like this. Make sure you hit that red subscribe button down below and give me a like and make sure you share my videos and it helps my channel grow as well too. So, all right, everyone. Thanks for watching.